right, welcome to game week, day four. What was the game this week, Andrew? Rampage! Or this day, I said, it's not this week. Rampage, excellent. We have special uh, special guest game player. Brady Scribner. Brady, thank you so much. This is Brady's game. He said that he had a game that he thought the boys would really enjoy playing. What do you guys think? It's awesome! <laughs> <laughs> Skills. Yep. And this tested our destruction skill. <laughs> <laughs> so can you tell me what it was what it was like, Andrew? Well what you do is there's this city that's built. Yep. And you have your monster guy and you have this token thingy that you click around. Yep. If I flip my thing and it lands on a sidewalk, I can use one of the actions to destroy. Hold my monster above the building and oopsies, I will just drop <coughs> yeah. it. Boosh! Stuff goes flying, including oh, obliteration. Which wrecks some of the floors, and what else comes out of it? Meeples. Meeples. And then what do you do with the meeples? Eat them. You eat them. You eat all sorts of things, because you're a big dinosaur in this game. Like if this. I you look kind of like this. And you eat stuff. Meeple going me. I ate an enormous stadium floor, and it gave me one point. That's right. One point. So, Brady, had you played this before? You had... Got it, just one time before? Uh, when I played it, um, my character gave me, um, gave me three points for a gray meeple and a black meeple. Yep. And I How many got 22 points from just black and gray meeples. Well, plus your set. You had a set. So yeah. you, got, you had four sets of black and gray. That's right. There's special points that you can get. There's all sorts of actions. What are some of the other actions uh, you can do, Owen? Oh, instead of dropping your dragon on a building, what's one of the other actions you can do? One of them is the most fun is yeah. when you uh, when you're close to a in, when you're in the same neighborhood as a um, van, a truck, or yeah. something. Yeah. You can put it on your monster's head and hook it at somebody, and if they fall over, you get your one of their tooth. Yeah. Teeth. Teeth. Yeah, you can destroy or destroy buildings that way, right? Yeah, or that and and Brady, what's the other thing you can do? There's uh monster breath. Yeah, monster breath. Yeah, and what's that, that like? That's very difficult. You put your chin on the monster <laughs> and you try to blow either gently or very hard. Yep. Uh, and try to knock some people down. That's or right. Knock a monster down. Yeah, it, it turns out it's really difficult to knock a building down with the breath, but it's fairly easy to move meeples, I, I think we've found. Yes, um, that's but, the intent. Of right, that. right. But blowing them off the board is bad. That can end up hosing you. Actually, uh, who yeah. ended up having the fewest teeth at the end? Because you could lose teeth. Yeah, Brady lost so many teeth early on, which really limited his ability to eat meeples. And we all know how... So I had to go and fight other monsters. Yeah, so he spent the majority of his time trying to knock teeth out of other monsters. That was his strategy. So, so I think it's, it's worth saying, who actually won today's game? You. Yeah! Yeah, that's right, baby! Woohoo! Day four, Dad finally gets a victory. Yes! Finally! All right, so would you guys recommend this to other people? Yes! Yes, yeah. definitely. Caution, it really pulls out people's destructive side. <laughs> that's pretty true. All right, well, that's the end of day four. Stay tuned for day five of Game, game Week! week. Now All right! Thanks again, Brady.